Okay, hi guys! Welcome back to another video. It's your girl Keisha K here. Um, you're probably wondering why the door's open and everything else. Yeah, uh, your girl's having car issues. It is hot. My AC is not wanting to, I'm just having like some car issues. So yeah, so today's video might be a little more quicker. It might be filmed in two days because I'm in the midst of like a car fiasco right now. But we are going to go into this Walmart while I'm in here to get cooling for my car. And we're going to check out the doll surprise boxes and all of that. So, um, and my coworker recommended this specific location to me. So thank you, coworker. But yeah, subscribe, leave a like, do all the good things that you do. And let's go in this store. Okay, you guys, so hopefully you can hear me, but we are seeing some dolls we have never seen before. I'm so sorry if I sound tired, if my energy is just a little bit off. I'm just very frazzled and frustrated right now. Um, so I do, like, I'm sorry if you can hear, like, the shift in my tone, but starting, let's start bottom to top. So we... Let's actually zoom in. Okay, you guys, so they have these style bay dolls and the decor dolls that I've been seeing people are really liking these decor dolls. If you don't know what decor is, it is a um, like a sub genre of Japanese street fashion. Um, it's mainly specifically based on accessorizing and kind of doing the most possible with accessorizing colors, prints, things like that. Um, and these style bays, I can tell they're trying to emulate the brat's face model just like a little bit. Um, but I don't want to go into those like too, too much just because I am like in a rush today. I'm so sorry. We, we will come back and like do a second video check in. Um, so next aisle, the Fresh Beats dolls. We've seen a couple of these, but I haven't seen her she reminds me a little bit of venus mcfly trap from monster high just with the pink and green color scheme and then they have these vip dolls um and i've kind of seen them too but if we're being honest i don't care for them um i don't know i don't really like the face mold but that's just me personally they do have to go up into the barbies they do have these like La Fenista and Naturalista dolls. We have seen Miss Lady here and here and here and here, but I haven't seen her. Her name is Kelsey. I do know a girl named Kelsey in real life. I think she is super cute. I am a one sleeve sucker, so I will always vouch for the one sleeve outfits. Um, these Naturalista and Latinista dolls are really, really cute, you guys. Um, and they have these like hair amazing dolls. I don't really know too much about them, but they are interesting to look at and they have like outfits to kind of go with them. Um, and they have these like Moodle dolls and I, I don't know. I don't know anything about them. We might come back to those maybe tomorrow. Um, but I don't, I, I don't like it. Not gonna lie, I just don't. But they have these love dolls and I, kind of love these dolls um autumn brooke london and harper these these are some really killer outfits i love the color schemes i really like they're all kind of like in they're like not edgy but it's giving a little like high fashion with the creative cuts the interesting not appliques, but just like like these shorts have like the little ties on the like bottom. That's so, that's, I just love that. Um, they do, it's kind of hard to fully tell in the box, but yeah, these, these are very, very cute. I am not against introducing some high fashion or editorial ed elements to um, fashion dolls. I think that's honestly one of the most fun creative ways to introduce them uh, to people. Um, and I, if you guys see like any of my old videos, um, I do model, I do professionally model. Um, 
I have done some high fashion shoots. I have done some editorial type shoots. So I'm not an expert, but I do kind of know what I'm talking about a little bit. Even this outfit here is really, really creative. Like these dolls are just very visually interesting. So far I support. So let's kind of go into Barbie and see what's going on with her. Okay, giving you guys an overview of the Barbie aisle because I am on a time crunch unfortunately. I'm not gonna go super like into detail about these but I did kind of skim through and I kind of want to point out some interesting ones. Uh, we have seen like some of the sport dolls but I do think these are kind of fun. Um, they do have like some Chelsea's here. They have quite a few Chelsea's actually. Um, where is she? I think, I don't like it, but I do think this is something we haven't seen before. Neither is this one as well. Um, you guys can kind of form your own opinions on her or on them. Um, we do have this, honestly think this mermaid doll is really cute. I actually really do kind of like this like little mermaid Barbie. Um, as we've seen, Chelsea Chelsea's, Barbie the movie dolls, Barbie and her many, many campers, cars, boats, accessory playthings. Going into Monster High, it is nothing we haven't seen before. I'm just gonna do like a brief overview just so you guys can, you know, see what I'm talking about. If, I will say we haven't seen the Frankie styling head. We haven't seen the Ghoul Mobile um, or this like interesting little like purple walker. I don't think we've seen that in any of our videos and going into rainbow high all of these we have seen before um let me know comment down below what your favorite rainbow high girl is or if you aren't a rainbow high girl who's your favorite doll in your favorite doll line because i'm very interested at one point not at one point but at some point i will be like making a discord after so many like subscribers and we'll all be able to just kind of discuss and talk and, you know, talk about dolls and share our favorite dolls, doll news, things like that. If you guys are interested in something like that, please leave comments. So I, the way, the only way I know what you guys support, don't support, like, don't like, is if when you leave comments. So please, please, please interact with your girl and leave comments for me. Um, but yeah, this is pretty much the, do the toy aisle. Um, they do have some LOL OMG girls. Some of them we have seen, some of them we have not seen. I think she is super cute. <laughs> um, they do have the Bratz. I We've seen all of these except for the Always Bratz Sasha. And I know I said I really like the Chloe, but the Sasha for Always Bratz gives. Sasha is the queen of the cargo jeans. Yes, like I absolutely do love the Sasha doll for that one. So let's see if they have any like surprise bags or surprise boxes. And we will wrap up the first part of this video. Okay, you guys. So I just kind of want to shout these out. We will look at the surprise stuff a little bit later. Um, I just don't want to be disruptive of the employees. But previous me, um, Keisha K in the past loved Furbies. Um, I am part of the generation that grew up with the original Furbies. I was born in 1998. Furbies came out in 1998. Um, so they have like these little like fur blitz. The new Furbies are very interesting, but something that I want to point out, Tamagotchi, they've been back, but it's really cool to see them like here as if they're like a new product. And these little like bitsies, I don't really know what they are, but I do like eight bit things. So I think these are kind of fun. And then I, not to bring up age, but I did grow up with the original For Real Friends. Um, so these new designs are just a little different for me, but I understand if people enjoy them, but I just kind of want to shout those out. There is like a giant tarantula toy at the bottom that I don't like. So we're not going to look at that. And then, well, actually, the employees move, so let's kind of peek. Um, mini brands, they have Pet Rescue, which I wonder if that's just a re, like a revamp of rescue pets from the 
mid 2000s early 2000s if you guys remember that they have anime pop surprise bat, surprise um balls they have pet alive just like a lot of mini brand stuff the, the mini verse not even mini brands it's officially the mini verse those have taken over the surprise world um they have these cutie cuffs for hello kitty star wars for the star wars uh people just yeah they have the little mallow mallows and the little stitch ones we have seen those before but yeah they literally just have a little bit of everything the up mal me mouse i didn't know these were youtuber brand owned so i think that's really really cool um i commend whoever the youtuber is that made those um because i can tell they put in the effort and packaging design and everything like that so hopefully i'll be there one day where i can have like my own little surprise uh surprise thing um and then i don't know who mariah elizabeth is but apparently she has like little mystery boxes so yeah you guys this is the overview so that's all i could really kind of find in this walmart so we did find quite a bit that we haven't seen before but yeah let's head back to the car hi guys i know it's a very different angle um i am not in my vehicle right now i'm actually in um my mom's car while my car is getting fixed for the next few days um you guys saw like a little bit earlier i was getting my um i said i was having car issues and i was really stressed out so sorry this is a weird angle i'm sorry if this is kind of unexpected we just kind of roll with the punches over here but that will be this is going to be the short version of this video um i'm so sorry this video was so short but thank you guys for watching anyway anyway not anyway make sure you guys subscribe leave a like do all the good things that you do um keep up with my community posts i'm definitely going to be using those more talk to me there um 1k q a is coming up leave all your questions in any of my comment sections or in the community post comment sections super excited to do like a q a for you guys that video is going to be a super special video like when we get closer like a lot lot closer like all like a few subscribers away from hitting 1k i'll be revealing what the video for the 1k special would be will be and at the end it'll be a q a um if you guys watch some past videos i do kind of leak some bits and pieces so watch videos that i've been posting lately and kind of you know join the party or whatever this is an awkward angle for me too so i'm so sorry you guys but yeah until my next video thank you guys so much for watching but yeah until my next video i will see you guys later bye guys